Well, after 25 years without a home playoff game, the Buffalo Bills will be playing in front of fans next weekend. We learned that tight end Tyler Croft will sit out tomorrow after testing positive for COVID. Now, COVID numbers are once again on the rise. So what should you be thinking about if you're watching from home or from the stadium? Two on your sides, Jackie Roberts has information you want to know. Jackie. Claudine, as we reported earlier this week, the first playoff game at Bill Stadium is already sold out with 6,700 fans allowed to attend. Admission is contingent upon a negative test result and contact tracing to follow. An infectious disease expert, Dr. Thomas Russo, believes it's a good plan, and he says he's more worried about the people watching with friends at home than those watching in person. That's for several reasons, including the fact that, of course, fans in this stadium will be outdoors. Dr. Russo says the virus will be more easily dispersed, and he says, as we learned from last summer, you're less likely to get infected in an outdoor setting. They're going to be screening the fans, and though testing is not perfect, testing combined with all the public health measures in place and the outdoor venue, I think, portends where it's going to be a relatively safe event. Obviously, the risk is not going to be zero, uh, but with the plan in place, uh, I think that risk will be minimized. And for the majority of fans who won't be watching from the stadium, Dr. Russo warns against gatherings indoors with friends and family from different households or social bubbles. He says those settings can be high risk for COVID-19, and despite our temptation, we should try to avoid them. We'll have much more on this coming up tonight at 10 and 11. For now, in Orchard Park, Jackie Roberts, Channel 2 News.